So, what do you want to see me about, Ernie? My grade. I'm not doing very well in this class. Well, that's not exactly true. You were doing very well until the last test. I got a D, Professor Adams. I've never gotten a D in my life. Before this, I mean. So that's why I'm here. I hope you can give me some advice. Well, from my class book, I see that your attendance is excellent. No absences, so that's another problem. No, I never miss class. I'm a serious student. I just don't know what happened on the test. Did you bring it? The test? Okay, I think I remember this. But there were almost a hundred tests to grade, so let's have a look at it. Thanks. Well, Ernie, let's see. Here it is. Yes, I do recall this test. You didn't finish it. You stopped after question 15. So you had five questions that were counted wrong because they... Um, because you didn't complete the test. I know. I didn't watch the time. And I just couldn't believe it when you asked us to hand in the tests. Yes, I see. But you did a good job on the questions that you did respond to. Professor Adams, maybe you won't believe me, but I know the answers to the questions that I... The ones that you left blank at the end. Yeah. So now... I need some advice about how to bring up my grade, because a D is going to make a big difference. The test counts 25%, so... Mm, you are right. It will bring it down at least a little. I know. Okay, then. The first thing is to learn something from this. You have to find a way to pace yourself through tests, or you are going to have this problem again. I know, and believe me, I learned that already. Okay, that's good. Now, what about the grades for this class? I was hoping you might give me a chance to... to maybe do an extra credit assignment. Hmm, I don't know about that. Oh. But here is what we can do. If you want to finish the test right now, and your answers are satisfactory, then I'll add some points to your grade. You will? I know the answers, really. I can't give you full credit for your answers. That wouldn't be fair to the other students, but I can add some points, and that should help you somewhat. Wow, this is great. Okay, just take your test over there and finish it. You had about an hour to complete 20 questions, so... That would be 15 minutes to finish the five questions you left a blank. And Ernie, pace yourself. I will. Thanks. Thanks a lot.